at the two point hospital, what do you think? Uh, I haven't looked at it yet. It's like the same type of deal, right? Except you're running a hospital. I love those types of games. Those are fun games. Um, but I haven't looked at it now. So yeah, it wasn't a rape. You're right. It wasn't a rape. It was a double murder. That's what it was. He caught his wife with another dude. And he came home and killed them both. And I was just like, okay, this is this is ridiculous. And it wasn't like lightweight either. They got they were they were pretty. Yeah, it was. It was pretty. Uh. It was pretty. You knew what was going on. So, does the new SLF affect normal ships or just Thargoids? SLF. Oh, ship launch riders. Um, I'm assuming Thargoids. Because they're going to be shooting, like, Guardian weapons. So, if you think about how Guardian weapons affect normal ships, I'm assuming it's going to be Thar better against Thargoids. So, I would put these in my, um, we did it. We did it! We did it! I'm gonna get extras, just in case I do something stupid. Um, I mean, I, this is what I put in, like, my, my Anaconda and my Corvette that I use. Actually, I just have an Anaconda and a Type 10 that I used to fight, uh, fight, uh, Thargoids. I would put these fighters in that. You know. I tried to get Epsilon for almost three hours and only got eight of them and nearly went insane. I've already gone insane. I've been doing this for five hours. <laughs> yeah, I'm already there. I'll see your postcard from insanity. No. I haven't been doing this particular thing for five hours, but I spent the first hour or so looking at the new ship and then I flew out to the new guardian site and I did the puzzles and then I started scanning obelisk data. So that's what the five hours entails. I just need one more just to give me some, some a little bit of a buffer in case I do something stupid. The description on the wiki for the three claimed that the Trident is better versus human ships than it is Thargoids. That is very interesting. That's actually kind of cool. The Javelin is effective against both. That's actually kind of cool. That makes them worth. And the Lance is purely good in Thargoids. So that's how they're balancing them. Okay. I just got a message for something. Oh, PowerPoint or PowerPoint power play. I've been with Lee Young Ru for how many months? And I still haven't got the anime missiles. <laughs> I don't know why I won't deliver that stuff and get that power play over with. I just, I, I don't know. I just, I just put it on the back burner and I never get it done. The javelin is close range. Have you tried or heard of RimWorld? Oh, ho, 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 ho. <laughs> let me tell you about Born and RimWorld. All right, yes. T short answer to your question. Yes, I have tried RimWorld. Absolutely amazing game that is highly underrated. I highly recommend RimWorld. Every RimWorld player out there who played it for who's played it for a long time, they always have stories. <laughs> and I'm glad I clipped mine. Because I wouldn't remember it all, but my the, the tale of my tragedy revolved around one little thing called these what was it beavers? It was like three beavers, three rabbit beavers that ruined everything. I sent people out to hunt them, and then all of a sudden, everybody's dead, and people are killing themselves. <laughs> It was, it was the most tragic thing. I was like, oh my gosh, what's going on? I mean, I had a perfect setup. Well, I had a good setup. And it was getting to the winter time where I was having to, um, I was running low on food and stuff and like heat and stuff, you know, the little challenges they give you. And <laughs> these stupid, these stupid rabbit beavers, man, they just came and attacked us. 
And I don't know what happened. It's just like they got they got one person. One person went down. So I sent out another person to pick them up and bring their body back. They got that person. The other guy was shooting from the side, missing every shot. I'm just like, come on, man. Missing every shot. Before I knew it, four people are dead. And I only had like seven people. And the other people that were back, they weren't good at combat. And so they came out, tried to hit them with sticks and whatnot. Everybody's dead except for one person. The one person went mad and started killing all the animals in the in the camp. He lost his mind. Until he froze to death and died himself. It was the most tra I was I was so sad. I was like, this is what happened to my people? Everything just like just crumbled because of those beavers. And I actually, oh, there we go. We got two epsilons. So that's a lot of extra. Um, so I have that clipped, actually. It's, there's a Twitch clip of that. <laughs> because I streamed it. And it was hilarious, man. It was so funny. Because it was just like, it's just how quickly everything could just like go downhill. Like you, you're just cruising along and then all of a sudden the game just like, well... I'm just going to make your life miserable now. I hope you're ready. All right. We're going to head back to a tech broker. So I'm going to head back to um, to Founders. And then go to a tech broker near Founders. <laughs> he wasn't ready. <laughs> oh, man. So this is this is like 14 jumps, maybe less. It's gonna be a long trek home. Goodbye, Guardian Sight. You have served me well. Hello from Sweden, by the way. I don't know why I trust black people a little bit more than white. Wow. Okay. Retract landing here. What does Kappa mean anyway? Well, I can give you a relatable story to that. I don't trust cats. Any of them. But I'll trust a dog with my life. So I guess we can relate that to what you said. I guess. I don't know. I actually think cats are trying to kill me. Oh, no, I'm scanning. We're off leaving this guardian site behind. No, I just, I don't trust cats, man. They, here's the thing. I, 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 all right. You can disagree with me and I'll respect it because people have disagreed with me. Cats train you. Despite what you may think, cats train you. You you adapt to what they do. And you love it. Okay? And I don't like that in an animal. I just, I prefer to train an animal and have it obey me when I tell it to do stuff. As opposed to, it might do it if it feels like it. And in turn, it will tell you to do something else instead. I'd rather not be a slave to a cat. I'd rather have a dog obey me. So, that's how I feel about cats. I don't, I don't like them. They just, they have their own agenda and I ain't got time for that. I'd rather get a dog. <laughs> you know what I mean? I mean, cats can be cute. Kittens are adorable. Yeah, meow. Meow, meow. They're, they're adorable, but I'd rather have a dog. I don't hate cat people. I don't, you know, people who have cats, I don't hate them. I just don't like their cats. Because a cat will know, if you have that attitude, like, you're not going to, you're not going to train me. A cat will look at you like, you're the enemy. I already don't like you, and I'm going to draw blood from your body. Three, two. 
So to me, it's like more give and you know, it's it's not a really a symbiotic relationship. You're you're pretty much the cat is draining you and taking all of your life, <laughs> and, you, and you just sit back. I'm gonna run the fuel. Hold on. I gotta be careful here. Let me make sure I got this thing set up right. Do I have my filter set up right? Probably don't. I'm only five jumps out, so. Um. All oh, right. I don't have this set up right. Star class. There we go. Now we'll get some fuel. But see, there's a trade-off with that. I understand, you know, dogs should be dumb as a pipe. You know, they're just they're just unconditionally loyal, but they can be dumb as a pipe. And then there's dogs that can be incredibly smart and loyal. And I prefer the latter. <laughs> Kung Fu, that's right. Getting a cat is playing the RNG game IRL. <laughs> Will the cat love me today? <laughs> RNG says, nay. You are the enemy of the cat. Go do his bidding. Fuel scooping. <laughs> you love cats for the reasons you don't like them. I, I just, I don't like being trained i mean my parents did that already i don't need an animal to train me i mean seriously i've heard people go oh sorry guys my cat is on my keyboard again there he goes oh no he's on my mouth stop you're chewing please you're chewing my head would you don't there he goes i can't i can't do it and you're sitting there helpless and the cat has taken over you. I'm like, would you get off my desk? I'm like, I don't get <laughs> No, 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 no. I mean, that's that's how they are. And I, I just, I, I don't like that. Some people like it, but I don't. They will take over. And I'm not saying dogs don't do that kind of stuff, but... But you train them to like you know like get out and then they, they get out Feels like you know get out of here and then go do this stop you know everybody trains their dogs differently i'm not gonna say that's universal but you could train your dog you can't train a cat cat will fool you you're like yeah you think you train me we'll see because to me that's not domesticated that's like a predator that's like a slow, like, it's like a, it's, it's the long game for animals. It's like, I'm going to, I'm going to kill him. It's going to take 20 years. Four, three, two, one, engage. <laughs> they play the long game, man. That's a, that's a 20 year predator. My human is a very good human. Fuel scooping. Drinking coffee at night? Yeah, I am. Cause this is my uh this is my work hours. I, I started a little bit late tonight. I usually start at four Eastern, but I started at eight. So I got another three hours to stream. Probably more. So I'm drinking coffee. This is this is uh I'm a full time streamer, so this is kind of my job. And I have to have energy for you guys, otherwise people leave. I found that RimWorld clip and it's hilarious. It's okay if I link it. Uh, I'll permit you just in case. I think it's okay. I just got a new bot and I may have misconfigured it, but I'll, I'll, I'll permit you. Why so late? I stream from 4 to midnight. That's not bad. Why do people stream early? Ask them that. They'll tell you, because I want to. This RimWorld clip is hilarious, man. Four, three, two, one. Oh, it's boars. I said I said beavers. It's boars. It was boars. <laughs> man, pack. Nine months ago, man. I was so addicted to that game for like a full week, too. And then I, I got I think I got sidetracked by another release and I, I haven't been back to it since. 
And I told people that I would go back when 1.0 is officially, officially, officially released, which is really soon. How many more jumps we got? Um, let's actually find this. Um, let's find this broker. Service. Tech broker guardian. I thought there was a, a guardian tech broker near Shinratar. Near founders. I'm going to have to go to Inara, aren't I? Yeah. This thing never does what I want it to. Okay. Uh... How do I do this again? Is it here? No. It's been a while. It's ancient rock. Oh, the, the guardian tech broker is? Okay. I knew there was something there. I didn't think it was a guardian tech broker. Okay. All right. Got it. Uh, yeah, it's Hydra. Hell Hydra! Cut off one leg. Cut off one head. Two more Texas, please. Four. Hell Hydra! Two. One. Engage. Anti Trivia, have a good night. It looks like it's just sharper. It's like the flowers. The petals are sharp. So it's like a it's like it's like a sh it's like a it's like a it's like a it's like a, it's like a, a ninja star, you know? Cut off one head to my Texas place. Hail Hydrate. Super sharp fidget spinner. Fuel scoop, <laughs> oh gosh. Jump. Roger. Alright guys, after I get these fighters, um I might try them a little bit, but I'm gonna have to switch games soon. I I'm, I'm gonna be playing some Monster Hunter tonight as well. And I'm already over four hours four, for this. Three, um, but I'm going to get the fighters. I think I can get the the FSD booster too. Um, and I might go launch them and, and, and fly around with them out, out the, outside the station a little bit. <clears throat> Alright, let's head to Jameson. Fuel scooping. Fuel scooping. We're going to be playing the Switch version of Monster Hunter, uh, which is Monster Hunter Generations Ultimate, which came out to, well, yesterday, because we just flipped to tomorrow. Uh, it came out yesterday, and I'm brand new to it, so I'm a noob. Pretty dumb. Don't know what I'm doing. I've, I've, I've got about 100 hours in Monster Hunter World, but that means nothing compared to this game. But we're gonna get the fighters, unlock them, test them out a little bit, and uh, if I can buy that one thing, the uh, what's it called? Where is it? Technology broker. Uh, if I can get the. For the FSD booster, I need HN shock mounts. I'm not sure if you can buy those or not. I thought I think there are there are quest reward, but if I can buy the shock mounts, then I can get the FSD booster. What happened to Amy? You happened to Amy? She's live right now. You just heard her. You can just buy them. Okay. Watch Jameson not have them. <laughs> oh.
Bum 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 bum. Studios here. What's up, man? Request docking. Shields at max. Shifting to crash protocol. Landing pad one, he said. Deploy landing gear. Wheels down, commander. Boop in the snoop. A hey, perfect. Ten out of ten. Would boop again. All right. So contacts, 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 contacts. Con okay. Technology broker. Uh, Trident. Yes. Javelin. Yes. And Lance. Yes. We did it. Oh my goodness, I need Guardian Technology Components as well. Alright, well I used all those. Um, so it's not just going to be about the HN shock mounts anymore. <laughs> Wang. Alright. Here's a duck. Let's, uh... What are we going to put him in our crate? You know what, let's put him in a new ship. Let's put him in a new ship. I just built this thing. Uh, I just built a uh, Crusader, which is a new ship added in this patch. We'll put the Guardian... Uh, fighters in this and then we'll just like derp around a little bit with it so let's go to the shipyard and uh, get our crusader it's not fully engineered we did a little bit with it No, I'm not going to look. I'm, I'm, I'm about to wrap up, dude. I'm going to try out these new ships and then we're switching games. There we go. Let's try the... Here we go. Trident. And we'll try the other two in a second. Uh, I guess I'll get a crew member for now. <sighs> Whatever, I'll just get somebody to fly the mothership. And I'm going to make sure that I fire him when this is all over. How long before all your emotes are blue balls with different faces? Nah, we're not going to go that route. We're not going that route. Don't worry. I've only got two. Two and a half. One of them's on better Twitch. Retract 90 again. I hope we are going to make some credits. Your balance is looking pretty shabby, Commander. Get to school, sir. Okay.
Woo. She's fast. Oh, there's heat, huh? External view. Ooh, look at that. Ain't she a beaut? It's like they're connected by like, these beams or something. Huh. Back inside. That takes a little bit to heat up. Warning. Temperature critical. What if I could hit my own ship? What happens? <laughs> I'm not the target commander. Stop that. Woo. That boost. Trying to hit it. See how much damage I could take. We did it. Fighter assembly initiated. All right, let's go try another one. Can you modify the fighters? I doubt it. There's not much you can do with fighters in this game. You're stuck with their stats. Boop the snoop to the max. Request docking. Request docking. I will note we are parked in the Donald Duck section. Deploy landing gear. Show them how a good landing is done, Commander. Boop. Derby David, what's up, bud? How you doing? Fighter assembly complete. All right, so. Outfitting. We'll try the second one. Which one was the one that um, that was balanced? That was the one that was good against, I think, the humans? Like, really good. Oh, no, I think that was the one that was really good against the Thargoids. Which one's the ones that's balanced? There's, it probably says it on here, doesn't it? Cause that was a trident. Then there's a javelin. I think the javelin is one that's good against uh, humans. I think. 
Let's try a javelin. <laughs> 